Hello and welcome to another episode of Excel Learning Series with Syed. In this episode we will discuss how to create a unique list in Excel. To follow along with me make sure you have a copy of this workbook downloaded using the link in the video description. There are plenty of ways to create a unique list in Excel. We will discuss some of them. The first method that I'm going to discuss is we will create a unique list right in that place. I want unique department names from this data set. There are approximately 10,000 records on this worksheet. So how do I go about it? I will simply go into the data tab on the top. Then under sort and filter group, I will click on advanced. This advanced dialog will give me an option. The first option says filter the list in place. I will let that be selected, but in the list range it is actually pointing from column A to column J. I don't want that. So I just want column F. So I will simply click on column F. Now it is referring only to column F. Now I will select unique records only and then click okay. It will filter the list in place with unique records only. I can simply copy this, take it into another sheet and paste it there. I have my unique records extracted. Done. Let me go back to the see it sheet now and here I will clear this filter by clicking on that clear button under data tab. Now let us discuss the second method. We will click on advanced filter one more time. And this time I will simply clear this list range and under action items I will select copy to another location. Under list range I will select column F and then under copy to I will just scroll towards right. Go a little more further and I want the unique list to go under this column then click on unique records only. And there we go. I have my unique records created. Please note you cannot copy this for some reason into another sheet. For example, if I try advanced filter and column F and I wanted to copy that to say this sheet here and I say unique records only, it will throw me an error. So you will have to do it in the same sheet. So that is the reason we copied that in the same sheet. Now you can take it from this sheet to wherever you want. So this is the second method of doing it. Now let us discuss the third method. How do we create a unique list? I will simply copy this column, copy it towards the right or into a new sheet. I'll take it to a new sheet here, paste it. And under the data tab, you have remove duplicates button. Click on that. It will give you a remove duplicates dialog. You just need the column C. So let that be highlighted and click OK. <coughs> done. You are now able to create unique list using these three beautiful methods. There is another way of doing it. It is little different but it's worth taking a look. We just need to click anywhere inside the data then go to insert. Then you click on pivot table and it is going to select the entire range. You select in a new worksheet. Just click OK. You have your pivot canvas where you can actually start building your pivot report. You drag that department name into the rows field area and you have all your unique department names right there. So these are different ways of creating unique list. You can copy it from here and paste it anywhere you like and you can start using that unique list based on your requirement. I hope you find this video helpful. We are going to explore more dimensions of Excel in the next episode. Thank you so much for your time. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and click on that little bell to enable notifications from my channel. Thank you and have a lovely one. Until next time.